previously on Savannah's Art Studio. Okay, I guess we're battling. And we're all done. Time to battle. Full picks, I choose you. Come on out, Frostma. But win or lose, I am really happy with how this turned out, and it's been so much fun working with April. We definitely plan to do more of these Pokemon battles, so stay tuned for that. Hey there, people of the internet. My name is Savannah, and welcome to my studio. It's time for the second Pokemon art battle with April Borschelt. This time we did shiny Pokemon, but the point system is still the same. Also, if you haven't seen our first battle, the links for those videos, as well as April's channel, are in the description. But before we get into it, if you're new here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and ring the bell to be notified about when I put out new videos, and be sure to give this video a like and comment on what you liked about it. I have a really exciting video planned for when I do reach 100 subscribers. It's going to be a lot of work, but a lot of fun, so let's make it happen. Also, of course, go check out the rest of April's channel. She's an amazing artist, and I have been so happy to be working with her. And if you would like to support me, go check out my Etsy shop, where I sell some shirts and prints, as well as my Instagram, where I post daily on some of the stuff I don't do here. Now let's get into the drawing. So, as you see, I already have most of the sketch done, and surprise, it's another bug. Scallopede is one of my most favorite Pokemon, and its shiny is even better. I love reds and teals together, it's my favorite color combination. So yeah, here's this big old bug horse doing a big old gallop or whatever. I futzed around with the eye a couple times because I wanted it to look fierce as if it was actually battling, but I didn't want it to look super angry. I've drawn Scallopede a couple times before and they all look way cooler than the actual sprite where he has like these short legs and a big chest, but I think this one in particular looks really neat. I also changed some proportions a bit so its legs look a little bigger and not so stick-like. I gave him a very horse body and pose and it just looks so good. I could see him being a trusty mount for some sci-fi alien race. Trying to make its weird triangle toes look like hooves was interesting, and I really like the back legs. I, I just love Scallopede, y'all. Making these teardrop shaped uh, spots was interesting, and after I got the shape that I liked, I just copy and pasted it. You know, as, as I, I do. <laughs> then some color sampling and flats. I'm still in the phase of only wanting to use this one brush for shading because it's really cool to me. It's a soft airbrush, but it gets darker depending on how much pressure you put on the stylus. So if you go pretty light, it's just a soft shadow, and you can gradually make it darker by adding like several strokes on top of the, the other. So I don't really need to blend when I'm using this brush. But I do still add my darkest shadows with my line brush and softly blend them into the airbrush.
I don't know what it is about teal and red, it's just so appealing to me. Whether it's dark red with light teal, or dark teal with a bright red, or whatever. It's so gosh dang pretty. I also love Scallopede's shiny so much I often forget what the original looks like, and so when I see it I'm just kind of disappointed. I eventually mess with color balancing to make everything much more saturated for an extra flare. Now on to the move! I chose VinoShock because it sounds cool and I wanted to do another cool beam with all of the things I've learned in Photoshop, like making stuff blur and overlays and all that goodness. Now, I don't know if the scallopede in the reference picture is using VinoShock, but it showed up when I googled images of the move, and it looks cool, and I don't care, Pokemon moves change all the time in the anime, so whatever. And then I just put some purple glows on everything and add shiny sparkles in post because I forgot. Now on to the battle. I choose you, Rapidash! Let's go, Scallopede! Use Flare Blitz! Get on with Vino Shock. So now with our point system in mind, let's see how I did with another bug against another fire type. Ah, oh, jeez. Well, April won again because fire kills my poor baby bugs, but that's okay. I'll change up my strat for next time. Congratulations, and thank you, April. And thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed our shiny battle. Let us know what theme you would like us to do next in the comments. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell if you haven't already. And take care. I'll see you in the next one.